Hello, readers and writers, and welcome to lesson 41 of your ELA School Away From School. I am Mr. Marks, and I will be your virtual teacher for today's daily lesson. Let's start by remembering our guiding questions. How do human actions affect the natural world? How do authors approach providing information and making an argument? And how does reading for research help me to form an opinion and make an argument? As always, we will be trying to address these questions with today's work. For today's lesson, you will need a copy of the text, Young People Urge Their Leaders to Act Quickly Against Climate Change, your copy of Lesson 41, the Lesson 41 Note Catcher, and a pencil. Go ahead and pause the video here and make sure that you have everything. We have one learning target for today. I can use prefixes, suffixes, and roots as clues to help me determine the meaning of a word. Remember that we have been using this strategy to help us find the meaning of unknown words for several weeks now. Let's make sure that we keep this target in mind during today's lesson. First, you will be rereading Young People Urge Their Leaders to Act Quickly Against Climate Change with a family member, caregiver, or friend. As you read along, listen to the read aloud from lesson 39. Pause the video here while you read. Today, we will be looking at prefixes and suffixes. These letters are letters that attach to a root or base word to change its meaning. We can use prefixes and suffixes to help us understand new and unknown words. What do you do when you don't understand a word? Now you'll have a discussion with your family member, caregiver, or friend. Prefixes are letters attached to the beginning of a root word. Some common prefixes include anti, over, and pre. Can you think of any words that start with these letters? What do you think that each of these prefixes means? And now that you have been working with prefixes, what other prefixes can you think of? Go ahead and pause the video here while you discuss. Continuing your discussion, suffixes are letters attached to the end of a root word. Some common suffixes include er, ik, and ist. Can you think of any words that end with these letters? What do you think that each of these suffixes means? And now that you have been working with suffixes, what other suffixes can you think of? Again, pause the video here while you discuss. Now, use the Lesson 41 note catcher to collect vocab words from the article that begin or end with the example prefixes and suffixes. Write your words in the vocab from text column and write a short, short definition for each in the vocab meaning column. Pause the video here while you work. All right, great job today. Think about how you did with our learning target. I can use prefixes, suffixes, and roots as clues to help me determine the meaning of a word. Share your work with someone and tell why you chose to write what you did. Also, remember to read a book today with a family member, caregiver, or friend for 20 minutes. For today's fluency practice, read the text with fluency and expression at least two times. All right, thanks for learning with me today. I will see you back here for lesson 42.